Good morning, uh, welcome, welcome to my YouTube channel. And this is Santos Caparim Jr. wishing you a good day. Now today what I'm going to do is discuss the staircase and lip lobby pressurization system, okay? Now what I have here in my screen is a system wherein it is a very important system in a building or in a project because it saves lives, okay? Now, uh, in my previous tutorial, I already explained how a pressurization system or staircase works. Now, anyway, today I'm going to explain it again for those uh, people who have not seen that video, then you can uh, check this video. Now, what I have here, uh, there are two funds. One staircase pressurization fund for staircase and one for lift lobby. Now, uh, as you know, during fire scenario, in the event of fire, the escape route of all the occupants of the building, let's say if it is a hotel, all the guests will be using the staircase. So what they will do, they will be entering the lift lobby, then they will go or use the staircase. Because as you know, during fire scenario, uh, you will never be able to use the lift or the elevators. Only one lift is available for the fireman's. That will be the fireman's lift. Okay. Now, uh, the purpose of this pressurization funds is to pressurize the lift lobby and the staircase pressurization for the purpose of preventing the smoke from entering these areas. Okay. Because the the uh, the one that kills people during fire is the smoke suffocation okay now so the pressure inside the lip lobby area should be greater than the pressure outside of the lip lobby and likewise the pressure inside the staircase should be greater than the pressure inside the lip lobby okay now what, what is the pressure uh, should be maintained in these two areas first in the staircase uh, we are maintaining there around 50 pascal okay so 50 pascal should be the pressure inside the staircase when all the doors are closed okay now uh, in the event of fire when someone will enter the lift lobby and go to the staircase when they open the door in the staircase suddenly the pressure will drop so to compensate the pressure loss this fan is controlled by vfd so bms will is the one controlling the speed of the fan. So when pressure drops here, fan will uh, speed up to maintain the pressure here, 50 Pascal, okay? So there will be a time that all doors will be open. So this uh, pressurization fan will run at full speed to at least maintain a certain pressure here, okay? Now, in the event of uh, the pressure, let's say all the doors are closed and the pressure goes above certain uh, amount, let's say 75, then there is a relief damper here. This relief damper will vent out the excess pressure here. Now, if what is the problem if the pressure go above 80 Pascal? Now, the problem is uh, the children or a toddler can no longer open the staircase that's why we are maintaining around 50 to 75 but uh, the, the most uh, likely pressure setting is 50 pascal okay but it will always depend on the uh, fire system guy okay they will be the one to give the pressure to be maintained here okay but that pressure is adjustable because as a bms engineer you have to provide this uh, BMS set point that anytime they want to adjust the set point, they can always adjust it, okay, for the staircase and lip lobby, okay. Now, I have also here some monitoring, control and monitoring points for the fan, okay. Now, you can see there the uh, speed control for the fan. Then, I have also some monitoring points and control points for the relief damper. So, this relief damper is the one. Uh, venting out the excess pressure in the two area, lip lobby and the staircase, okay? So again, guys, uh, I hope I have given you uh, an idea how a staircase and lip lobby pressurization system works. And thank you very much for watching this uh, short video clip. And again, this is Santos Capellan Jr. 
uh, saying that if you are new to my channel, please subscribe and you can click also the notification bell and you can always leave your comment so we can discuss whatever question you have in your mind. Then I'm saying again, God bless us all and bye for now.